Yes, he is. Yes, he is. Yeah, be honest, Father. 
praise Him. Yeah. 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 Lord, I'm so yeah. glad yeah. Lord, praise God. Yeah. 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 First, I'd like to give honor to the Lord, my Savior, Jesus Christ, yeah. head of my life, who I trust in yeah. this morning. We give honor to uh, uh, the Lord and Jesus Christ, and also the elders this uh, morning, the honor of Elder Donna Parker from Charles Hill Association, and Elder Bobby Thompson from Georgia. From Georgia. We're glad to have him this yes, morning. Uh, come be with us this morning. We give honor to our mothers here. And to all our sisters, all our saints and Christian friends, uh, down to the little boys and little girls, we give honor to uh, uh, the Anderson Chapel, Missionary Baptist Church family, Sister Drew Fred, and Brother Camilla Stanson, and we give honor to my brother here this morning, and his sisters, and his daughter. Man, thank God for this million dollar wall. Amen. Welcome here at the New Bethlehem Association Union. And we had a good time on yesterday. And we're going to try to pray that the Lord bless us and have another good time today. So we come to praise the Lord, everybody. We come to give God some praise. We have to tell God, thank you. We have to say, hallelujah. For nobody will go. We thank God. Bless him up one more time. On this side of the world. It's joy in the Lord. It's joy in the Lord. I tell everybody, it's joy in the Lord. It ain't no, it ain't no evil in God. It ain't no evil in the devil, but joy in Jesus Christ. Uh, ain't it all right? We thank God. We get ready to get on this union train till we get down to the end and to close it up. At well, this time, we got the delegate from the. Uh, uh, Tom Dillard was supposed to Elder Donald Parker. We were asking him to come and read the scripture lesson and preach what does say the Lord. And why he come, let us all give our serious attention. They may have what spirit says unto the church. I'm not telling you, he's the hammer, yeah. They yeah, may yeah. have what the spirit says unto the church. Now you got to have the ear. And when you, hear, when you got the ear to hear, you know how to act. When you got to hear, you hear, you know how to preach somebody. When you got the ear to hear, you know how to love right. Yeah. When you got the ear to hear, you know how to serve God. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Jesus. That's why what I said. Good morning, church. Good morning. Good morning. How's everybody doing this morning? Good. It's good. 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 It's good to see y'all this morning. Yeah. 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 I enjoyed being with y'all on yesterday. Thanks the Lord who was able to meet us here again today. Amen. Amen. It is an honor to be in the house of the Lord this morning. Amen. Amen. First, give an honor to God, to my Lord, the Savior, Jesus Christ, who is the head of my life. Yeah. Yeah. To the pastor of this church, Ella Axon. Mm -hmm. To Reverend Robert Thompson. Bobby Thompson. Bobby, Bobby Thompson. Mm -hmm. From Georgia. Mm -hmm. To the Dixon brothers. Yes, yes, yes. Martha's sister, Saints and Friends. Hey. I'm down to the little boy and the little girl. Yeah, yeah. Kudos and honor for us to be here this morning. Oh, yeah. We're not going to uh, waste the time this morning, but to move on, because I got two fine preachers back right here behind me. Mm -hmm. and I want to be the one to hold up the train. Mm -hmm. I, I, want to, I want to hear them preach today. Mm -hmm. And enjoy listen to the listen to the other I son on. Yesterday. Mm -hmm. Now I want to, I don't know if nobody rest y'all, but I want to hear some more today myself. Amen. 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 So we're gonna move on along. Uh, like I was saying, uh, wherever the Lord put me in, I stay there. 
So he decided to do something that's different. Because mm -hmm. I tell him I can never finish it up. Because he always allowed the spirit to keep feeding me more and more to where I'm already at. Uh -huh. But this morning we're going to go over here to the uh, to St. John. Uh -huh. Chapter 6 over here in St. John. And talking about uh, this is after Jesus had fed the 5,000 with two fish and five loaves of bread. And for the people that he fed, when they came back to the place where Jesus had fed them met over there in our Tiberias, when they came back, they didn't find Jesus and his disciples in that same spot anymore. Mm -hmm. So they took shipping themselves and went over to Capernaum, or Capernaum mm -hmm. where they found them men. And we gonna start at verse number uh, chapter six, verse number twenty-four. We're gonna start at verse number twenty-four, chapter six. And it reads, "When the people therefore saw that Jesus was not there, neither his disciples, they also took ship and came unto the crown, seeking for Jesus. And when they had found him on the other side of the sea." They said unto him, Rabbi, when camest thou here? Mm -hmm. Jesus answered them and said, Brother, brother, I say unto you, You seek me not because you saw the miracle, but because you did eat of the loaves and were filled. Labor not for the meat which perished, but for that meat which endured unto everlasting life. Yeah. Which the Son of Man shall give unto you. For him had God the Father sent. Yeah. Then said they unto him, What shall we do that we might work the works of God? Mm -hmm. Jesus answered them and said unto them, Jesus answered and said unto them, This is the work of God, that ye believe on him whom he has sent. Yeah. Uh -huh. They said therefore unto him, What sign showest thou then? that we may see and believe thee, yeah. for doest thou work. Now Jesus had already done it. Showed them a miracle. Mm -hmm. But they wasn't paying no attention to the miracles. They were looking at God because Jesus know. He said, y'all didn't come sit me because of the miracle that I showed you. Mm -hmm. He said, y'all come, y'all came because I fed you. Mm -hmm. Because you ate and you got the stomach full, and now you come to rip, rip, you come looking for me again. <laughs> but now, this is what came up to me yesterday. If you get a trip, somebody right, if she's right today, don't allow the world to put you in a box. Uh -huh. See, because all these many years, we have always heard people in the world and saying that church folk ain't no more hypocrites. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Because you go and you sit in church on Sunday, and then on Monday through Friday, you're out there doing the same thing that we that we do. Mm -hmm. See, because we are supposed to be the ambassadors of Christ down here on the earth. Mm -hmm. The world's supposed to be able to see Jesus Christ mm -hmm. through us. Mm -hmm. But how can the world see Jesus through you when you out there doing what the world is doing? They're trying to eat a whole bunch trying to convince people to come into the church. But they said, why should I come into the church when you do the same thing that I'm doing? Right. You don't give the world no kind of hope if you're doing what they do. Right. Because they say that because back then, uh, 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 let me put it like this right here. There's a difference between religion and Christianity. Right. Because so many people had gotten caught up into religion to where they were getting all about what it means to be a real Christian. Yeah. Mm -hmm. See, John said over there in our first John 4, John said, believe not every spirit, but try to spirit what right. the faith is of God. Yeah. Right. He said, for many false prophets have gone out. Yeah. Right. You might know you're the spirit of God. Every spirit that confesses that Jesus Christ is coming to the flesh is of God. Yeah. Every spirit that confesses not that Jesus Christ is coming to the flesh is not of God, but this yeah. is the yeah. spirit and the Antichrist. And then right. you have heard of this and come, even now has already been going out into the world. Right. So just like, Paul, just like Paul said, if any man come preaching another gospel that we ain't preach, he said, let him be up here. Okay. Because a lot of people done got tied up with the other preachers and other religions to where they say, it's all right to do this, it's all 
And now when you come to the church and bring that money, you live in the way you want to live. You do what you want to do. It's all right to have a wife and a girlfriend on the side. It's all right to have two street little illegitimate children out there. Please tell them it's all right to do anything and still serve God. But how can you serve God and the world all at the same time?
Then on Monday through Friday, they go to work on Monday. On Monday, they there trying to talk to that gal, and that gal over there, the wife working over there. Yeah, they're doing the same thing, and these people is living there. Mm -hmm. and, 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 and they know, they, they know that deacon's supposed to be a deacon in the church. But yet still, Monday afternoon, he was right there at the liquor store, trying to get a, a bottle of smell in our house. I tried to do some brand. Yeah, I saw that brother over there, out there the building. Yeah, he had a whole case of Corona. Because they don't even drink blood water no more, because they got an old man here. <laughs> they got to all this modern stage there now. I'm going to do the old man with a message for that. <laughs> well, I know that boy's supposed to be a church member, but he's ready to get some fun to be in line. But don't let the world put you in that box. And do what he does, find do what he does, but don't let the world see you like the way that he is. Let the world see the true spirit of Christ and live on the inside of him. Because the world is looking at him. We're supposed to be there, hope. Up to salvation. But how can you get the world, hope? We're just doing the same thing. Yeah, yeah, the world is doing Boy, there, boy, there, we're talking about, boy, I see, I see some of them. I see some of them. I'm not going to tell you, I don't got no truth. I see some of them. You better have said the wrong thing to them. Better have said the wrong thing to them. Boy, boy, you see some words come out of their mouth. You never thought that was in there. They were supposed to be in there, but it's in there, though. Uh -huh. She, 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 she called, the devil going to let you know that I'm in here, too. You might go to church and poop hard and all that right there, but guess what? When I get you around D on them, I want that D on them know that I'm up in here too. So he'll let himself come back. He's gonna let himself show. And just to show he's in there, he's gonna show himself. See, but then why? You can't have two. You can't have the spirit. See, she called the spirit ain't gonna dwell in no unclean church. No. See, in order to be a true person of God, the Spirit of Jesus Christ, the Spirit of the Holy Spirit, you got to come alive on the inside. See, 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 come. The, the, the devil ain't dumb. He ain't dumb. The best trick he ever played was to get man to think that he didn't exist. What he does is his brother, I know. I know what he thought he had. But when God grew, when God grew him up, Drew me away from it. That Rasta got mad. Yeah. He got mad. And come, y'all don't believe the thing that I have been through my, in uh, my lifetime. First, after, after, after God got me working on it. Because the devil got mad. He done everything he can to try to break me. But God told him. The Spirit told him. To he said, You let no man shake your face in God. And I've been holding on to that one commandment for almost 30 years ago. I've been holding on to that one command. Because mm -hmm. I know I got him. And he's going to do everything he can uh -huh. to try to break your spirit. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's that, that why Paul said, put on the whole arm of God. Oh, that, that you may be able to stand against the wild of the devil. You got to put on the whole arm of God. This ain't a sudden moment thing. You got to put on the whole arm of God. You got to put on everything yeah. to tell that you did. So that's the only way you want to be able to stay in against the wise of the devil. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I mean, he ain't no dumb fella, because he'll come ready to your home, on your yeah. job. It don't make no difference. Yeah. I've seen him stand right there in the church and bring people up against the job. Yeah. Right there in the church. Because yeah. he will do it. Yeah. He will do it. See, you that thing about unity. And long as you stand together as one, he ain't got no toe But yeah. go, go, go. if you ever get a look, yeah, in between them, uh -huh. he don't come in the tree. Yeah. Yeah. Everybody yeah. get a look at Yeah, A snake don't need that big hole and call it in. He ain't got a look at that. Oh, he ain't got a look at that. And see how he called up in there. Yeah. Yeah. Because that's all he needs is just a look at mm -hmm. See, that's what Jesus said. They only came for the food. They only came for the food. Mm -hmm. I'm going to tell you the truth, back. I'm going to leave y'all alone. Right. See, all that thing, that, he got to mess with the net uh, last week. Y'all know how it used to be back in the day. Digga, hey, you know how it was, who was at Mount Hall Church down the town? Quarter meeting came, uh -huh. but he had a whole trip for the fun. Uh -huh. Had a whole trip for the fun. They came from all over, everywhere. Uh -huh. Boy, they, they from, from, from different denominations and everything else. Boy, they used to come down there 
Man, come and know the chariot was going to be the, the chariot was going to be there with the nephew and all along. We're going to get some good saints. We're going to get some good saints. Then like the rest of the folk get mean now. We're going to get some good saints. Oh, they're going to come back. Oh, they get some good kids. Oh, they get some good calling. Oh, they couldn't the best stuff. They well, they couldn't the best cake. They couldn't the best time. Oh, they got one stuff down there. Well, she cooked some good shit. She cooked some shit. See, she was cooking the hall mall. They couldn't get a different tree. Chilling in the hall mall. The whole thing they love to have a pack of public. But they kid each other do. Because they didn't come to get the thumb food. And they want to preach a Christian back. And they couldn't eat that. But they didn't come seeking Jesus. They didn't come seeking the world. They came in and want some food. See, well, Jesus said, death just temporary. Death, death, death just going to fill the body for now. But he said, me, me, I'm the, I'm the everlasting. Yes, yes. I'm the everlasting. Yes. Yes. The word that the preacher should, the, the preacher was preaching, that's what you need. Yeah. You need that word to sustain you until you come back to church again. Yeah. Because you yeah. believe, because soon you need a church, the devil standing right out there waiting for you. He's standing right out there waiting for you to get on the outside of the church. Yeah. Yeah. And he's coming. He's coming. Because yeah. yeah. guess yeah. what? Uh, 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 all right. Jesus was talking about uh, uh, them different rocks. Yeah. Where, 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 where they fell. So, where them seeds. Uh -huh. Some fell on stone, some fell on the thorns and the dust, then some fell on good ground. Mm -hmm. When you get outside that door, the devil said right out that way. See, but the word, the word, Jesus is what you need to sustain. Yes. Yeah. To hold you. Yeah. Because the longer you work the word, the word is going to work. The longer you work the word. Yeah. See, well, you got to put on the whole on the whole yeah. and not to be able to stand against the evilness of this word. Yes. And you see how this world is going. Yes. Uh, you get the plan, you can't even say this. Can't even say, say, or say that. Mm -hmm. They ready to carry you to court if you tell them about what they really is. Uh -huh. They're going to sue you because you ought not be preaching that in the church. Mm -hmm. If I can talk about Jesus Christ, then what else am I going to talk about inside the church? Mm -hmm. I talk about it on the outside of the church. I talk about it on the inside of the church. Mm -hmm. Just like that deacon told him down there, deacon told him, I know what he was going to do. Yes, uh -huh. uh, sir. Uh -huh. I know what he was going to do, yes, sir. And he already said the, 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 the son of the folks right down there at Big Little Hut. Mm -hmm. I was going to put out the church, too. Mm -hmm. But he had no say sir. So. Uh -huh. Come down there, talk that no. Come down there, don't talk that no. Uh -huh. We ain't got to invite you down here. Talk that no. Okay. If you can't talk about Jesus Christ in the church, so what else are you going to talk about, man? Yeah. Jesus is in the church. Yeah. Yeah. He said, and if Paul says so right there in the Ephesians chapter 1, where he said that God made Jesus the head over everything pertaining unto the church, which is his body, the fullness of him, the fill of all in all, Jesus Christ is the church. Yeah. If you don't talk about Jesus in the church, what else are you going to talk about? Hey. <laughs> if you ain't got no Jesus, you ain't got a church with Jesus in it, you just in the devil, dude, because that's all you have to I talk about Jesus in the church, outside the church. I talk about it at home, in my car, grand I talk about Jesus Christ. Yeah. Because that's the bread that I need for eternal life. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Because all this bread of food, it's just, it, it just meant for just a little. Yeah. Just a little See, but that's what the world wants. That's what a lot of folks want. Mm -hmm. They worship their big houses, their fine car, their money, or their $300 suit. They worship all these things. But these things are just temporary. Yeah. It's just temporary. Yeah. Just, just, just like in the day, we get upset, we go get a bottle of milk. But it was just a temporary thing. Yeah. Because soon you sober up, come kind of all morning, you still got the same problem. Yeah. Ain't nothing changed, you still got the same problem. Yeah. It's just a temporary thing. Mm -hmm. Jesus said that the air is going to pass away and the food is still up. All this is going to pass away. If you ain't got Jesus Christ, then what do you want to have on that side over there? Mm. You ain't can in the house with you. That Jaguar and that lesson, it ain't going nowhere. Mm. What you need is Jesus Christ. Because yeah. that's the only thing that's going to stay yeah. on that right. side of the house. Oh, that's the yeah. only thing that's going to stay on oh, yeah. Let me get out here and leave y'all off. 
Don't let the world put you in a bar. Amen. Because they said that we just a bunch of hypocrites. And some are here. I ain't gonna tell you nothing wrong about it. Some are here. I see what they do. And they in church on Sunday. I guarantee I get tired with this afternoon. I see someone right down there at the store giving them some bills. I ain't gonna tell you nothing wrong, but I used to do the same thing. Mm -hmm. Get back when I was just, I was in the church, but the church wanted me. Mm -hmm. I just joined the church because my wife was going to church. So I, I, I went to the church too. Mm -hmm. The church wanted me. Soon as I leave the church, I go get me some beer. <laughs> got to the corner way, I got the nothing and Ryan car, and he wasn't condemn me, so I started going to the other store with people that know that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Because I was in the church, but the church won't let me. But let me tell you, I ain't ashamed to talk about me. But I know what I've done. I didn't have to go, and I shouldn't have got to have to nobody else. Because I know I was a hypocrite, and I was a hypocrite right. Mm -hmm. See, but when God started working on me, uh -huh. when He put His work on the inside of me, God was really me. Really when, he, when He put the work, when He started working the work, uh -huh. everything else. At the least. Mm -hmm. And that thing I know, all that other stuff didn't make no difference. Mm -hmm. I had one scene in there, and there was smoking a new book series. <laughs> and I refused to stop smoking. Mm -hmm. I went for Newport, the new the Newport light. Mm -hmm. I went to Coo. I even went slammed by the camera. <laughs> the most cigarette that did it used to smoke back in the day. Because I needed that nicotine. That flesh needed that nicotine. <laughs> Well, on my birthday, I never forget, it was on the week, Mark, 20 folks, about 20 years ago. Mm -hmm. That was, he taught me how to fast. And I told the Lord, I said, if it's meant for me to serve you, take this sin away from me, and I never go back and pick it, and pick it, and take it, pick it up again. Mm -hmm. And I prayed once that morning at, at 8 o'clock that morning. Mm -hmm. I prayed twice at 12 noon. I prayed again at 5 o'clock that evening. Mm -hmm. One for the Father, one for the Son, one for the Holy Ghost too. Mm -hmm. And that's been 20 years ago, and I never smoked another cigarette. See, but I had to hold up to my end of the body. Mm -hmm. I had to hold up to my end of the body. I asked him, and he did it, but mm -hmm. I had to hold up to my end of the body. Because I had an enemy who steady kept coming back to me. Uh, you know how we used to do back when we wanted to relate? If you couldn't grab and get us a beer and, and, and smoke us a cigarette and sit there and relax. And every time he caught my jump up, start doing something that's different. Mm -hmm. Because the devil will come to you. Yeah. Yeah. He will come to you. Yeah. But it's something you to be able to stand against the wild of the devil. Yeah. And all the way you're going to do that with the devil, you get in the devil's spirit of crap coming back. Yeah. 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 Come on. It ain't nothing but a holy one. Yeah. You have to let Jesus come alive on the inside. Yeah. Of course, because he don't come alive on the inside of you, you just believe. The yes. devil don't come. Yes. He don't come. Yes. And he knows that exactly what it takes to get to each and every last one of us. He knows what it takes. Yes. But it's up to you to be able to stand against the wild of the The only way you're going to be able to do it, you got to have the power of the Holy Ghost living on the inside. Yes. 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 Let me get out here and leave, leave y'all folks alone. Y'all have a good day and I know. It's all right. Amen. Amen. Our hearts burn by the hand of God. Talk to us by the wayside. Hold up the scripture to us. Box. You don't never know how to block you again. <clears throat> One thing about it, um, God said He never leave you nor He forsake you. So He be with you all the way down to the end of the world. I'm look for God uh, because He coming back, church. Yes, yes. I always tell Him all the time. He said, coming in the clouds <laughs> and coming down the road. Yes, I tell folks all the time. You do think you think you're getting away. You ain't got away. God knows where you live. He knows your name. He knows where you stay. He knows where you're going before you 
get in on your thing, you know everything. But God is on the way back. You ain't got to have God, have to tell God nothing what somebody done. He said, everybody got a need for his sin. I'm going to judge every man according to that work. He ain't going to judge the mama. Uh, for for daughter, he going he to he judge mama for mama and daughter for daughter. Right. Yeah. Everybody got to meet the man. This time we going uh, down in Georgia. Um, the pastor uh, Bobby Thompson, my brother, sister, daughter, mother, daughter, brother, brother. Uh, child might go soon. I see him come, he come all the way from Georgia to see him. And they ain't going to set no doors in the table and come and and stretch the center, people with dust in the Lord, why he comes for it. Let's all give our serious tips, may he with the spirit. Say I'm to the church, Bobby Thompson. Come on, in your way. Yes, Amen. 
And I thank God, I thank God for the preachers that uh, come before me. Uh, you know, God got a way of doing things. Yes. He said, let every word be established by two. Yes. Uh, yes. With me, so I remember when I was here the last time, the pastor got up and beat the message up. Then he come back today and this preacher get up and stepped all across my message. <laughs> like what in the world? <laughs> and I used to run, but the Lord told me that that was just his way confirming what he wanted me to deal with. I'm not, I'm, I'm not I, I, I promise I'm not going to be before you long. And then so many times we try to adapt messages. Um, and I'm guilty. I, I, I've been guilty. But uh, in, especially in my young years, I've uh, been preaching now since 82, but we, we try to adapt messages to our program. Yeah. What I had to learn in life that you can't put God on a program. <laughs> Come on, somebody. Come on. Yeah. Because in reality, God is the program. The program. Yeah. 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 And some some folks when we, when we get with them programs we we will stick with that program regardless of what the spirit yeah. is telling us to do. Yeah. Yeah. Amen. But if we're gonna be children of God, we got to learn to be obedient yes. to the spirit yes. of God. Uh -huh. And whatever the spirit moves us uh -huh. to do, or whatever the spirit moves us to say, we must learn to obey God. Because it's better to obey God than it is to obey man. And because contrary to proper belief, man uh, don't have no heaven or hell. Right. Oh, right. He can put you in the fire. Right. Amen. He, he, he may kill you. He may extinguish this life. But my Bible will say, if any man die in the Lord, yeah. he shall You'll pick it up again. You'll pick it up 
in our body, mm -hmm. regardless of yeah. your circumstances or your situation, you can attest to that God has been good. Yeah. 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 My, my, my. Yeah. 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 I will declare that many are the affliction of the righteous. Yeah. But God will yeah. deliver yeah. all. Yeah. 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 Yes, sir. Man that is born of a woman is a few days. Mm. Full of trouble. Full of trouble. Yeah. 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 Ye
together. Come on now. Mm. But if I can get two or three of them, mm. you ever have the whole church? My, my, my. If I can get two or three of them, yeah. yes, sir. <laughs> my, my, my.
came behind him and touched the hem of his garment. Uh -huh. Verse 21, for she said, within herself, I'm talking to the sister. She wasn't talking to the church mother. She wasn't even talking to her past. That's right. This was a personal yeah. conversation yeah. she had with her sister. Yeah. Uh -huh. yeah. You got we gotta watch that. Uh -huh. Folks he ain't talking that cost right. <laughs> Oh my God. Hmm. 
But we say, man, we don't need to preach. Huh. Mm. I got this same Bible he got. I got uh -huh. the uh -huh. same Holy Ghost he got. Uh -huh. Mm -hmm. Uh -huh. And I'm not saying you don't. Perhaps you do have the same Holy Ghost. Somebody ain't gonna like me. Come on. Mm. You got the same spirit he got, but your the, 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 the spirit, the gifts of the spirit, the anointing of the spirit, what a lot of folks don't understand is given by measure. Yeah. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Mm. Uh-huh. In other words, if you're all the members of your body are members uh -huh. of one body. Uh -huh. But you got one head. That's right. Mm -hmm. Two hands, mm -hmm. two feet, mm -hmm. two ears, mm -hmm. two nostrils. Mm -hmm. Huh? And some of us talking up there, have two mouths, but we ain't got no one. But you got one head. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And 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 truth be told, your hand can't physically do nothing. That's right. It's sick. It's sick. But when you want to drink the water, your hand tell your hand. Uh huh. Mm. Uh huh. To pick that glass. That's the deal. Mm. Uh huh. Talk to me, somebody. That's right. Mm. That's right. Mm. That's right. Tell. Hey, tell one come, tell another go. Uh -huh. Tell one do this, another don't do that. Uh -huh. Tell one to stand up, tell another one to sit down. Yeah. Your, when your soul get hungry, it's your head that tell you, I want a piece of cornbread <laughs> <laughs> and fried chicken. <laughs> Because when you get hungry, uh -huh. if your head don't kick in, if that's oh, those electronic signals that your brain will transmit don't take place, you'll be walking around hungry and don't, and don't, don't know what you're doing. <laughs> <laughs> When a person get, we used to say old times, all times, uh -huh. we mentioned it. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. There's an electrical magnetic dysfunction in their brain. Yes, right. Yes, right. And it's, it's not making the right connection. <coughs> but we've got to a point now to where we make, we don't need that. But the Bible says, how can they hear without preaching? That's right. How can he preach? Except he be sent. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Tell y'all a secret. I want you to tell me. Everybody preaching. Uh oh. Ain't been sick. Mm. Uh oh. There you go. Uh oh. By God. Mm. There you go. You might have a close picture. I ain't I ain't seen it. <laughs> mm. Uh-uh. 
Mm.
cross and all you got to do is deal and I just trust him up for everything he's done. Yes, amen. I hope and pray that when you come back to the cell for him to come. Good and great to serve him. Uh-huh. Come on in, sir. Yes, we are. We're not going to wait for him long. We're going to sing our songs. Or a season again. Be grateful for all of them. You know, maybe the time when I'm free, they just got no wind shell. I see the chance. The rain is going to be on the earth. We all want you. Yes, sir. Oh, wind
Good hand of the Lord. And God knows it. And you know, where you may be, when Jesus comes back, we got the rain. Good hand of the Lord. Well, those that are going back with him. I'm going to read it. You know, you know. We're going in the book of Revelation this morning, you see. Well, I'm about to, the sixth chapter of Revelation this season. Hope we live in that time. Well, right now. Yeah, we are. People don't realize what's going on. Well, folks are not preaching, ain't teaching, and telling them. What will it say in the book of Revelation? <coughs> Sixth chapter 10 at the first verse. When John was told to uh, read and write the, in the book and, and told him about everything God told him to write. Yeah. Uh, John started writing from, from the first all the way down to the twenty. The last chapter of Revelation. So the sixth chapter read just like the first word. He said, And I saw, I saw when the Lamb opened one of the seals, and I heard as it was a noise of thunder, one of the four beasts saying, Come and see. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. And I saw and behold a white horse. He that sat on him had a bow and a crown was given unto him. And he went forward conquering and to conquer. And, and when he had opened uh, the second seal, I heard the second be said, come and see. And there went out another horse of that reading. Uh -huh. And power was given to him that sat there on to take peace from the earth, and that they should kill one another. And it was given unto him a great sword. Yeah. And when he had, had opened uh, the second, the third seal, I heard the third he said, Come and see. Uh -huh. And beheld, and lo, a black horse. And he that sat on him had a pair of balances in his hand. And I heard the voice of the, in the midst of the four beasts saying, A little wheat for a penny, and three million of barley for a penny. And see, God hurt not the oil, nor the wine. I believe that's what we have read from the sixth chapter, first verse, all the way uh, to the sixth uh, verse. Where you read it, thank God in your heart. And I just want to leave the thought with you this, uh, uh, this, this season. It's already here. Mm -hmm. It's already here. Yeah. Oh, yeah. And, uh, uh, and nobody can say it. Not here because you see it now, ready for your eye. It's all ready here. Uh, we're glad to be here. We're going to go time on this unit. We're not going to wait for long. The Lord's oh, blessing just speak just a few words uh, in the midst. And I'll be out of the way. And uh, I tell them all the time we living in last days. Uh, we're living in time now. Uh, uh, hate is all over the world. It don't make no difference what kind of tongue you hear, but somebody got hate in the home. Yeah. And uh, somebody just don't like you. Somebody just don't love you. Uh, because we live in, in that time now. Uh, thank God, all right. We just want to uh, go back and thank God for my laying down last night. Yeah. And uh, thank God for the angels uh, that came around the bedside yeah. all night long. Yeah. And uh, thank God for uh, waking me up this morning. Yes, um, Lord, a few times this morning. And they able me to rise this morning. And and find that the blood was still going on in my hand. And looked around at my home and my family circle had me been broke. I want to tell God thank you. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Lord. And thank thank you. To live one more time. Uh, thank you, God. This side of the room. And, uh, and God be good to us uh, all the many years. And Jesus, he always been there for us. He's with us right now this day. Yeah. And Jesus said, I never leave you. And oh, I God. I never will be safe. I'll be with you all the way down to the end of the world. Yeah. Because he said, I am the first and I am the last. And I am the beginning and I am the end. Then in the church, I am the offspring of David and I'm bride of yeah. yeah. Come on, yeah. I'm about to cover my hand, and I'm, I'm so broad. Yeah, yeah. 
name great on my thigh. I'm low, low, and I'm king of kings. Ye hold up in my name. See death all over the world. Can't see it in 
all the four parts of the world, every kind of hunger, they're crying for hunger, and they know why they're living in a world of shame. They don't believe in God, they just believe in here, and they die because they haven't repent from the sin. They have not even said Jesus Christ, kind of blinding us out on the table. When it opened up the fifth season, mm -hmm. that there was an earthquake. And that earthquake shook the whole world. Yeah. And we ain't seen, we heard about it. Earthquake in other places. But it's going to be an earthquake right here in North Carolina. Mm -hmm. Let's keep on living. And by that time, he opened up the other six season. And tell me by that time, say he looked on the altar. He saw the soul of them that was slain from the word of God yes, uh, yeah. and the testimony uh, of Jesus Christ. Yeah. Uh, and they were down there on the altar. Yeah, yeah. They've been through so much. I know, yeah. I know a whole lot of them been through something. Yeah, yeah. whole lot of them been through a whole lot. Hurting uh -huh. all the time. Yeah. Moaning all the time. Trouble on this meeting. Yeah. Trouble on their meeting. Yeah. Trouble on the job. Trouble in your home. Trouble everywhere you go. Don't got, don't been talked about, been abused. Uh, in the church, seems like the church uh, don't even want, to, want you to come in the church, but somebody got something out there, and God got somebody want you to come to the church. God got somebody gonna tell you the way to sin is there, and the gift of God is eternal life. And say, so they were down there on the Good God Almighty cried out, How long? Oh, how long? How long? How long I had to suffer? How long I'm gonna go ahead and be able to have happiness there? But God will give it them, or to keep them white robes on. God will able to put time on. And go walk around the streets of heaven. All day. 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 All Blow out the whole sun. Uh -huh. yeah. And when you blow out the sun, uh, the whole world, yeah, it's going to get black as I call it. And you won't be able to see your mama or your daddy, your husband, wife, mm -hmm. or your children. But God blow it out of the main body. And ain't going to be no secret life all going to take no place. Yeah. Uh, ain't going to be no uh, not generator or take up no life. Uh -huh. yeah. And God blow out the light. Uh, it's going to be dark. And you know, all right. Yeah. And you know, you found in dark. Lord have mercy, you'll stay in dark. And, uh, and tell me, and by the time, uh, they said the rich man, and the bond man, and the free man, and the captain, and all the great men ran, uh, in the mountain, and ran, uh, even in the rock, uh, and you know, all right. And cried out, uh, how I mean, uh, for the face of him. Uh, that shit on the throne. Uh, for the great day uh, of the wrath of the yeah. And who shall? Who shall? Uh, yeah. 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 Uh, if you ain't been born yeah. Yeah. Uh, you cannot stand. Yeah. Uh, if you ain't set Jesus Christ, uh, it'll be too late. Uh, it's already in the day. Yeah. Uh, what's in the revelation? Uh, of the sixth chapter of revelation. Ain't God, uh, ain't with God. Uh, Lord have mercy. Uh, can you see these things? Uh, all it happened, uh, and by the time, uh, when the Lord blew out the sun, uh, he gonna call the angel, uh, and God leave, yeah. uh, he gonna call Gabe, uh, yeah. put one feet on land, yeah. uh, and one on the sea, yeah. uh, and grab out, uh, time, yeah. uh, and you know, know. uh, and God alright, uh, put God on my, uh, Lord have mercy, and bring it out, out. uh, you be real dog, uh,
prepared. It's already here. Get prepared. It's already here. It ain't gonna get no better. But we need to get better. Find ourselves. Get it close to God. Every day. Because it ain't gonna get better in the world. But God wants us to continue. Thank God for Jesus. I'm glad we're here. Yeah. I ain't scared to preach. Yeah. I ain't scared to tell. Yeah. He told me, continue. Yeah. Tell the truth. Yeah. And uh, folks get scared. And tell folks the truth. I'm scared you might come up into the church. Say, I'm leaving. Uh-huh. And uh, you're leaving because the gospel been preached. Yes, you're leaving. Oh, you're told you stepped on. Oh, yeah. You leave because oh, you don't want to hear the word. Yeah, true. Going somewhere else. And if, if, if that place where you go at, preach the same doctrine. Hey. You just made a big mistake. Yeah. Or that same man that folks be preaching God's gospel when you go here. Folks be preaching the same gospel. Hey. Yeah. If he ain't, he's creeping himself on the road. Oh, yeah. If he ain't, yeah. he turned away from God. Yeah. If he ain't, he ain't doing what God told him to do. Yeah. No, no, no. God told him to do it too. I don't see it. I don't care who you are. Because God called me. All right, God. All right. And, uh, I said, I was 19 years old. God called me. Uh-huh. And it brought a day out. Ran the back of him. Uh-huh. And then when God called me, I ain't been in my college. I ain't been in no seminar. Mm-hmm. God called me. All right, yes. And that's God to call me. But he saw fit to call me. Yeah. I didn't want to come here. Now I was shamefaced. <laughs> Ain't no way in the world. Back in the day, you could be standing for some folks. <laughs> I tried it when I was school. Yes. Doing the oil report. Yeah. Never yeah. Yeah. I believe I was in the ninth grade. <laughs> and uh, they, they, everybody got to stand up for the class. Yeah. Uh-huh. And my time was right out that person. Uh, they had these areas. It was a girl who spoke so wonderful about her report. And by the time my name came up, as soon as they called my name, the bell rung for the call. I got out of the I didn't ever turn it back. Well, that's and about three days later, God got me out of his box of me. And God's all right. But I went back to church, and my older days got my high school diploma. I thank God. God. He got everything you need. Don't tell me you can't do it. You can do it if you try. You can do it if you got faith. You can do it if you got God on your side. God has been the way I know it. There ain't nothing impossible for God. Everything you stand in call God could have been happening. I know you. You will. And tell your children. And your children, children. Teach them the right way. Teach them the right way. And uh, don't let your, your, your young men, boys, what do you got? Come up and be a girl. Don't let that happen. Mm-hmm. Don't let your girls come out and talk to man. Don't let that happen. Mm-hmm. You know what they did? They're fun this shit. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. Go straight ahead. Mm-hmm. And you, you support it? You support it? That's right. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. You got to tell them. You tell them the way you see them. And give a go. For the way we got the president of the time, that's his fucking. But I ain't got that. We're a we're going to talk again. That's all preaching, y'all. He said, I made him again. What he said, he made him again. Male and what? And female. He made male, then he made a female for that male. He made female, then he made a male for that female. He ain't made no two male, he ain't made no two female. Because if he is, I will be here, you won't be here, nobody will be here. Because two males cannot. Perform that time. It got to be a different sex, male and female. Uh, That's what I fight against. And I'm going to keep going on preaching because God called me to preach. Mm-hmm. Nobody paid me not to do, not to tell this, and God paid me not to tell it. God paid me to tell it. Mm-hmm. You know what he paid me with? That place called heaven. Yeah. He ain't paying me no dollars. He paid me heaven if I do like it. He told me to do. We thank God. Glad to be here. One more time on this side of the world. We here at this church. 
every first, second, third Sunday, we here. Come see us in Tallboro, down in Johnson Chapel, on Bright Avenue, 901 Bright Avenue, Johnson Chapel, Premier Baptist Church. That's for Sunday. Come check us out. And we we'll be sure to come get the word. Everybody got the door closed now. Whole lot of folks all over everywhere got the door closed on Sunday. I'm not yes. in the house for doing what they want to do. But the church door stays open. Yeah, yeah. And God gives you the opportunity yeah. to walk in. It's free from me. Yeah. I bet you one thing now. If you have a pop or somebody that sang and showed up. Uh-huh. And sang real good. Uh-huh. And pop around. You couldn't even feel, you feel all these chairs in here. And folks were standing all in, all in the That's corner right. everywhere, all back in the kitchen because of Sam. Right. God is telling me about uh, Sam is going to keep you healthy. He said, my word. my word. He said, my word the only thing going to stand. He said, heaven and earth may pass away. He said, but my word is going to stand. My word. So take God serious. Because he's coming back. He told me to tell me. He's on the way back. He coming to yeah. me and coming out man. Right. He is the only source. Honestly. That is the only source. He's in north, south, east, and west. That is the only source. All mankind got an answer him. That means right. preacher, deacon, mother, friend, what else? Yes. Oh, yes. All yes. got an answer to the same thing. If he ain't, ain't finding your work, he like John said, if he ain't finding your work perfect, what he'll say? Apart from me. Oh, mm-hmm. God bless you. Heaven come. Do a church. Do a church. Do a come. And join the church. Church will choice will come. We do all our in our powers. Lord mercy stands in all day, all night to the Pope. And he won't knock out door church. Oh, God, he said, Father Sam, let's do him. Amen. Oh, man. Now it's going to If you miss me from Sam, you can't find me nowhere.
Come back. 
It was moving the second on yesterday in our conference. Uh, the church takes the communion this afternoon. This portion of the service and people will uh, get ready for Passover. And uh, when y'all stay before we all Passover, uh, and also we got plenty of food back in the back. When we finish that, we go out there and fellowship with one another and have a good time. Uh, thank you. And we all come to the village and be back there. Because we're going to be going to treat company with very special in our company. In fact, we're going to stay in place. And while we take care of our class, so we won't have class over for us. We are welcome to do that as well. You know, we have to leave. Uh, you know, we have to leave. We just want to take. Thank you for coming by today. Because it's a blessing when we come in the house of God. Yes, there ain't nothing wrong with coming in the house of God. Sometimes you might become a cane with a heavy load and leave with a light. Yes. Because the word of God has touched you somewhere or another down the line. So nobody has no hand in the house before we so we can let you go. Very well, all right. I just like to uh, thank the New Bethlehem Association, the New Mount Island, New Living Living Hope, John Chapel Church for the money that they donated to Tyrell Association meeting. And uh, I told the people there that I'm going <coughs> I was looking for two thousand dollars. And well, the Lord he showed me promising that he put it out there. I'm 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 getting there. I still got some more coming in and I'm and I'm getting there. Amen. To that mark. That's the close I probably can, but I thank uh New Bethlehem for what they have done so far. Uh sign Sunday will be taking up that collection down at Paul Chapel. And I uh, also did that the second Sunday in uh, June. We'll be having a quarter there at Paul Chapel Church. I know y'all be busy down here. Uh, if any uh, like to come out and visit us, you will most, you're most certainly welcome. And also in London, Parent of Baptist Church, I'm also <clears throat> my sister pastor down there as well, just right on Highway 42 in Wilson. They've been having their quarter the third Sunday in May. The third Sunday in May. I know y'all be busy, but if anybody want to come by, you're most certainly welcome. I know they be glad. They be glad to have it. Amen. And I'm not going to be here. Come on, Ray. Come on, y'all. Just with you, we'll be back down here for a while. I have been with me in service. 
Also, I'll right announce this afternoon at 6 o'clock at Well uh, Baptist Church in Michaelsville, Well Chapel Baptist Church in Michaelsville. We have a ministerial fellowship service there, there this, uh, this afternoon. And we all the preach around Pine Top, uh, uh, the Methodist Church, the Baptist Church, and uh, Reverend Rob Weed Church. Uh, and Michael Field, Washington, Grant, St. Louis, and my church here, my church, and we have a uh, fellowship service, uh, minister fellowship. Steve, minister of fellowship. That means we raise money to help somebody around in this area that need, need uh, uh, assistance with medication, assistance with food. They go give you a grocery, uh, both voucher. Uh, you can't buy nothing but food, and you can't buy nothing but medicine. You can't, the trade off getting nothing else. You got just got to have food and medicine, medication that we raise money for. And also, uh, the night we'll be singing to every ch church, gonna sing two uh, hymns, song. And we thank God we got all these little young youth. They're gonna be there with us this evening and help us uh, open it up, sing their song. They pray me about the hymn. Uh, they love to sing the hymn. And, and you know how it is when you sing a cappella, it's just meltdown in your soul. Yes, yes, and right. And they can do a real good job. That's they they be well chapter church in <laughs> Michaelsville. See, I hope to have some of my church members go down there and help back them up. It ain't no need to put the youth out there and you go home and leave them out by the cell. Come on, you got to support them. If yeah. you don't support them, then they'll fall by the wayside. Yeah. And so, please, if you can, let us meet, meet them out there. Well chapel, Baptist church in Michaelsville. Thank you. All my heart could be going to be dismissed when this portion of the service. Let us all stand. No, Lord, we thank you for this service thus far. Lord, we thank you for the spirit that you have given unto us. Now we're going to move to another part of this service, Lord. God, we thank you. We pray that you would be with us as well. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. 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 Amen.